The Windows Registry is an important database that stores configuration settings and options for the Windows operating system and many of the programs you have installed. If you ever need to make changes to the registry, you should back it up first. Coming up, I'll be showing you how to easily back up and restore individual sections of the registry. After that, I'll show you how to back up and restore the entire registry. To open up the Registry Editor, go to the search box in the taskbar and type Registry Editor. Select it. You may get a User Access Prompt window displayed prior to this opening. If you do, click Yes, and this window will open. Another way to open this is to press the Windows key plus R. In the Run dialog box, type RegEdit. Press Enter on your keyboard or click OK. If you just want to back up a section of the registry without having to back up the entire registry, here are the steps. In this example, let's say I wanted to make changes to the keys or subkeys of Microsoft Excel. To back that one up, go to H key current user. Double clicking any of the folders will expand them. Expand software. Go to Microsoft and expand that one. Then expand Office. Find the folder for Excel. Do this part prior to making any changes to the keys. Right click on the folder and select Export. Choose a place to back up this file. I have mine in Documents, Captures, and Backup. Give the file a name you'd recognize if you needed it later. I'll just call this one Reg Excel. When you're done with that, click on Save. Now with it backed up, you can now make the changes you intended. After you've made your changes to the registry, if for some reason you did not like the result, restoring the backup to the section you are working with is quite simple. Locate the backup file. In this case, mine is regexcel.reg. Double click on it. Prior to seeing this window, you may see the user access prompt window again that you saw earlier. If you do, click yes. In this window, clicking yes will restore the registry information. Now I'll show you how to back up the entire registry before you make any changes to it. Reopen the registry editor using one of the two methods I showed you earlier. With it open, click on a file in the upper left-hand corner. In the drop-down menu, select Export. This will open the dialog box for the Export Registry file. Navigate to the folder where you want to save your backup file. Once again, mine will be in Documents, Captures, Backup. Give the file a name. For example, I'll just call this one Backup and Today's Date. Name it whatever you want so you can easily recognize it. Make sure the Save As type is Registration Files. In the section for Export Range, select All to back up the entire registry. When you're done with all that, click on Save. This will take longer than the example I showed you earlier. In addition to storing the backup on your computer, to be on the safe side, I'd also recommend storing it on an external drive. Restoring the backup for the entire registry is the same as doing a section, which I showed you earlier. Just double click the reg file and follow the prompts by first selecting yes. Thanks for watching. If this video was useful for you, give it a thumbs up and share it with others. Stay tuned for future videos where we do actual changes to the registry to make improvements to Windows. And if you're new to our channel, subscribe and click the bell to not miss out on our latest tutorials for Windows and other tech-related stuff.